my first season at Cranbourne and it's been fantastic uh, making use of the good facilities. Uh, we came over with a couple of nice horses that uh, yeah, ended up winning five in a row um, and that was quite pleasing. Uh, but yeah, just uh, the people over here have been fantastic and we notched up a few wins and um, built a, quite a nice team. We've really enjoyed the hospitality of people from uh, being here. Of course, the facilities, and uh, yeah, we're waking up each morning happy to be here. Um, the horses are happy, and, and makes us happy. Scotty and Kylie, they've been uh, amazing help to me and Sophie. Yeah, probably couldn't have had the success that we have had since uh, we've been over sharing the barn with them. I mean, numerous times they've uh, lent us their float and, and, and just helped us out really. Just, uh, yeah, you could say it's been like family since we've been over. Uh, my goal for 2024 is uh, yeah, just win more races each each season, but really focus on getting in these Group 1 races and hopefully picking one up. Um, yeah, that's sort of my aim, aim as, as soon as possible. And when push comes to shove, he just darts away and puts a gap in them. Son of Mac, he's, he's one to really look forward to next year. I think uh, we, we had a little setback in these um, He's met the right people and, and got that sorted out. He had a bit of time off and he, he'll come back a four-year-old and, and just the time off, I think, is going to do that horse the world of good. I went out the other day and seen him. He, he looks a pitcher and he's really developed into, into a proper, proper horse. Everyone's been amazing since moving over, definitely our clients and our owner base. Uh, yeah, got plenty of support from New Zealand and Australian owners. Uh, that's been amazing. And yeah, probably thank uh, Sophie Jeffries. Uh, obviously, we moved over together and um, yeah, it's, we've supported each other and uh, it's, it's made the move worthwhile and really looking forward to next year.